You know, we brought you a lot of stories recently about McDonald's offering more healthy and low-cost food. But there, when was the last time you saw them promote the burger that the restaurant was founded on? This week, we marked the 45th anniversary of the Big Mac, but you probably didn't hear much about it. Well, tonight, we take you back 20 years into the archives for when the days of the Big Mac was king and the ads that trained us to name off all the ingredients. It's the titan of burgers, the Big Mac. Today, it celebrates its 25th anniversary. Did you know that it's better every year? I eat it because it's juicy and it's not, well, it's never overdone. And, uh, well, it's a full meal. McDonald's says it sold 14 billion of these triple decker burgers. It's the fast food giant's biggest seller and the world's best known hamburger sandwich. Special sauce, wait a minute, uh, special sauce cheese on a sesame seed bun. I can't remember the order exactly. <laughs> it goes like this two all beef patties, special sauce, lettuce, cheese, pickles, onions on a sesame seed bun. Ever wonder what's in the special sauce? Well, I'm not at liberty to give you all that information, but uh, it's good. <laughs> I can't tell you what it is, but yes, it's a secret sauce and it's an excellent sauce. It's a patented sauce and nobody else has it. Today, the Big Mac is as well known as Ronald McDonald and the Golden Arches. In 25 years, ingredients in the Big Mac haven't changed, but the price has. It's gone from 49 cents to $1.80. Inflation accounts for a big part of the price increase, but the Big Mac's popularity is growing. Today, it's sold in thousands of restaurants in 66 countries. Chris Allen, News 12. Okay, we updated the cost of a Big Mac for you. Back in 1968, it cost 40 cents. In 1993, the price was a buck 80, and today, that same burger, probably a smaller size of it, it sells at $3.89. Wow. Well, times are yeah. changing, huh?